Greetings, Tenno. Good to see you again. This is episode two on how to decorate your dojo. Let's start by talking about room capacity. When going about decorating, before you get started, pay attention to the amount of capacity attributed to each room. Some rooms have more capacity than others and some decorations take up more capacity than others. Keep that in mind when decorating. Your capacity budget is very important. Okay, next up, let's get acquainted with the decoration system. You do so by pressing Start, selecting Decoration, then Decorate, and boom, you are in decoration mode. Now, you can fly around, Place objects wherever you like, except some areas close to the console and doors. There are ways to get around it, kind of, but other than that, Warframe offers immense creative freedom for dojo decorators. It allows you to turn this into this, and this into this. Having said that, let's go ahead and look at what we can do when placing objects. Notice the controls window located to the right. Get familiar with it. The buttons vary depending on the platform you play, but I will show you what each option does. Ascend does this. Here is rotate. Notice that when I press ZL for rotation, the billboard facing option changes to tell me the current rotation axis. While keeping ZL pressed down, I can press R, also known as right bumper, and this action gives you three possible axis rotations. Try them out. Next is billboard facing. Basically, this makes the decoration face you as you move around. Another option is push, pull. We also have hold to scale. And it works like this. Hold down indicated button. In my case, it's left on the pad then press up and down for scaling. In my case, I point up and down on the right stick, or I can just press up or down on my D-pad for scaling. Then we have placement. This gives you the ability to place objects freely like this, or with surface snapping which I only use anytime I want to fix an object's alignment. Then you have cycle grid snapping, which I never use. Then there is confirm for when you're ready to place the object. And lastly, we got cancel, which will undo all changes made to the selected object. With this, we arrive at the end of this episode. Remember, decorating is a process. Take it easy on yourself and think outside the box. Thank you for watching. Till next episode, cheers.